I'm Will Brown, marketing manager for Radical Sports Cars, and we're here on Radical Stand at the Goodwood Festival of Speed, uh, our first proper stand here with the magnificent Radical Rapture, our first all new track and road car for over five years. And, and it's a magnificent thing. Um, we believe it's the most focused track car on the market, um, road legal as well. Uh, and, and with a wealth of, of new developments and, and, and new features that we can fit within our, within our range. So it's powered by a 2.3 litre Ford EcoBoost engine um, that's comprehensively worked over by our in-house uh, engine division, Radical Performance Engines. They fit a manner of uh, forged items, uh, bespoke turbocharger setup, dry sump, and a whole host of other advanced electronics to the engine to produce 350 horsepower, 320 foot-pounds of torque. Uh, and that endows a car with 165 mile an hour top speed uh, and a staggering 0 to 60 time of, of a shade under three seconds. Um, one of the really dramatic things and what makes it unmistakably radical is of course the aerodynamics. And this car for the first time features a double tunnel front diffuser. It's the first time we've used this type of aerodynamic device on the front of one of our road cars. That really uh, creates a huge amount of, of high grip uh, downforce, particularly in braking and under high load cornering situations on track, uh, but you can really feel it on the road too. Um, then as we move down the car, find at the back, we've got a big Venturi rear diffuser as well to really suck the car down. So there's a huge amount of underbody grip, uh, underbody aerodynamics that, that, that are created by this car. Um, but it's not all hardcore track action too. Uh, once you get inside to the car, it's very well appointed. We've got electric mirrors, there's a heater, there's a very advanced data package with an AIM LCD multifunction display. Um, that, that gets you sort of all the information you need on, on circuit and on the road as well, and a host of other track options that you can add to, uh, to really make it your own and personalise it. The Rapture, of course, is fully road legal under the UK's IVA process, as well as being a, a very track focused product. So you can use it on the road. Um, there are several concessions in terms of the lighting package, but it is unmistakably radical. It's a very dramatic sight, a real head turning car. And I think even out on the circuit with the way that we've developed the aerodynamics, that really is what sets it apart from other performance cars. Even on the road, you can feel the grip, you can feel the downforce working even from a low speed. So the Radical Rapture uses a lot of the technology that we learned from our Le Mans programme and from our acclaimed SR series of race cars, but we've had to make quite a lot of changes and, and there are a lot of differences between that and, and what is very much a, a road car. So in terms of the spring rates to really control the damping, so you still get that real high grip and, and roll control on circuit, but at the same time you get that compliance for on the road. Um, we use a different seating. Uh, type arrangement uh, with a, ultimately a much more road focused, more upright seating position so you can see more of the road. Uh, and the interior is just a, a, said a, a more appointed place to be with a leather trim interior, uh, a heater, electric mirrors. It is, is a much more sort of road focused product in that respect. It's taken Radical about 18 months to develop the Rapture. Um, this was something that was first on the drawing board, yeah, back in the, in the beginning of, uh, of 2017. Worked, uh, sort of worked through the concepts in, in late 2017 and then really development started in earnest at the beginning of 2018 with this new 2.3 litre EcoBoost engine. We've done a huge amount of, of testing over the winter and into, into the spring. So this is a, a product that's ready to hit the track and indeed we'll be taking uh, deliveries from, from here at Goodwood um, for, for orders that will be uh, ultimately fulfilled in the beginning of August. We've set the pricing at, at £89,500 uh, and there are a wealth of other options you can, you can take to customise your car as well. Um, orders are already in place, in fact we've already had a, a German and a French customer already place pre-orders ahead of the show such as their excitement for this new car um, and we'll be taking a limited number of orders now for build slots through the summer with the first deliveries taking place in early August.